Hey guys, Geeky Chick here. Today I'm sharing my daily routine in Animal Crossing. I find it easier to make sure I don't miss out on important tasks each day by keeping a list. Geeky Squad Patreon members can download a digital checklist to track their daily activities on their island. Link to join my Patreon is in the description. Check your mail. I check my mail every morning from notes from villagers, friends, Tom Nook, Mom, and Nintendo. Did you know you can actually move your mailbox to anywhere on the island? Shake trees. Shake trees on your island each day to find gold, wasps, and wasp nests, and up to two pieces of furniture. I always make sure I have my net in hand when shaking trees so I can be ready to catch those wasps and prevent being stung. Hit rocks. Hit all your rocks for resources and to find money and find the money rock. You can hit the money rock up to eight times. Find the shining spot. Dig the shining spot for a money bag and then replant a money bag of your own to grow a one-time use money tree. I plant 10k each time and get 30k back. Harvest trees. Harvest any fruit and money trees you may have on the island. Non-native fruit sells higher on your island, so planting different fruits can earn you more money. Save your native fruit for crafting, energy, or to sell on a friend's island. Water flowers. Your villagers will help out, but if it's not a rainy day, be sure to water all your flowers. That's the only way more flowers and hybrid colors will sprout up. Log in to the ADB machine. Checking the ADB machine each day will give you a Nook Mile bonus each day. Don't break your streak so you can get the max of 300 each day. Also, check the shop for rotating inventory. Check Recycle Bin. While you're at Resident Services checking in on the ABD machine, be sure to take a look inside the Recycle Bin. You can find rusted parts, sampling, saplings, <laughs> flower seeds, resources, and discarded furniture. <laughs> Find message bottle. Every morning there should be a message bottle washed up on the beach. This will contain a DIY card. Did you know message bottles also show up on Mystery Islands? Dig for fossils. Check your island for buried fossils. Dig them up and get them checked out by blathers. Donate the new ones to the museum and save the others to sell, trade, or decorate your island with. <laughs> Visit Nook and Cranny. Check out what Timmy and Tommy are selling at the Nook and Cranny. The inventory changes each day. Don't forget to look at the wallpaper, flooring, and seeds inside the cabinet. Check hot item of the day. You can make good money using extra resources to craft the hot item of the day. Upgraded Nook and Crannies have two hot items. You can speak to Timmy and Tommy or check the sign outside the store. Turnip prices. 
Ask about turnip prices in the morning and afternoon if you're looking to sell turnips you bought on Sunday. Visit Able Sisters. Check out the newest fashion selection at the Able Sisters and be sure to talk to Sable each day. Once she gets to know you, she will begin to give you free patterns to customize furniture with. Complete Nook Mile tasks. Complete all your Nook Mile Plus tasks that give times 2 and times 5 bonuses. As always guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully this list was helpful. Don't forget if you subscribe to my Patreon, you get a cute little digital checklist that I created and lots more perks. Links are in the description along with my Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and all that good stuff. I'll see you guys next time.